everyone. As Nicole mentioned, uh, my name is Katie Hancock. I am a BP fellow, a messenger of peace hero, and a scout. Um, I'm here to tell you a little bit about my journey and how your contributions are changing the world and creating a better future for the scouts and, the, and all of the world's population. So, my story begins um, as a scout leader in 2015. I was the leader of my group and we were planning on doing a camping trip one weekend when we heard troubling news of some floods happening in South Texas. Um, being a scout and knowing that we should do our daily turn and knowing we need to help those who are in need, uh, we decided to reach out to our local community and uh, gather donations to take down to the flood-affected communities in Rio Blanco, Texas. So, uh, we headed out and we met up with the local Red Cross and um, we delivered our donations. Then we went door to door and we uh, asked those affected by the floods Hi, I'm a scout. I'm here to help, and what can I do for you? And doing this, we didn't think anything of it. We weren't doing it to receive an award or a certificate or advancement. We were doing it because it's scouts, and we're the, it's the right thing to do. So, uh, like me, there are 50 million scouts around the world who do their daily turn and complete service projects big and small all over the world. They do this through programs like Messengers of Peace, which helps them plan their projects and gives them the resources they need to complete them. Um, Messengers of Peace see scouts around the world, identify challenges in their community, and then take action to change them. And when we complete all of these projects around the world, uh, we get a lot of service hours, uh, around 1.1 billion, actually. In this last November, I had the honor to join His Majesty the King of Sweden in presenting these hours to the United Nations as a dedication to the Sustainable Development Goals to be completed by 2030. And when our scouts complete these projects, it's bigger than just the scouts themselves. These projects are affecting those in need and the community permanently from what those scouts have completed. And similar to that, uh, the SDGs, the Sustainable Development Goals, they are bigger than any one person, the United Nations, any organization or young person involved. The Sustainable Development Goals are aimed at every single person in the world trying to make a difference. Um, and so that's where you get involved as BP Fellows. Uh, we're thankful to have your support and your resources and investments because your actions are helping scouts all over the world make change. When you invest in scouts around the world, your investments go towards three things. Um, to inspire scouts around the world to take action and change their community, enable scout organizations to make capacity building trainings and to help their volunteers, and to deliver projects and programs in scout organizations in countries that lack the resources. So thank you. And we also want to say thank you to our volunteers. Our volunteers are maybe our most important currency as they um, bring time, energy, and passion to our program freely. So, I wanted to say thank you again for inspiring all of the amazing people around the world and all of the scouts around the world. And uh, we're gonna hear from a couple scouts from this region and we're gonna see how they made change in their community and we can think about how your investments and your resources are helping them in the future. Thank you. Thank you. 